Holy balls, y'all. Hey everybody, and welcome to an empties video. I was recently cleaning out my vanity in my bathroom and stumbled across this huge mess. When I mean mess, I mean there was empty product bottles all over the place. So I figured it was high time to do an empties video. So let's get right into this. So I'm gonna start in categories. I've laid everything out on my desk here and we are gonna start with shower items, work into some skincare, and then finish up with some makeup. So grab a snack. It's gonna be a long one, y'all. Okay, so something you should know about me is there are some things that I am super particular about and other things that I do not care about whatsoever. As long as it gets the job done, I don't care what brand it is, I don't care much how much it costs, I just don't care. That being said, shampoo and conditioner are two of those things that I just really don't care about. So, I have some L'Oreal Paris shampoo, it was fine. And I will let you know if things knock my socks off or not, and if they don't, I'm not gonna talk about it. How's that? Um, also another shampoo, Neutrogena Clean Volume, which is fine. And then the only conditioner that I used up was this Neutrogena Triple Repair, which was just fine. I also have this other Neutrogena Shampoo, the anti-residue formula, and I really liked this. As for body products, I used up the Pure and Natural Hypoallergenic Body Wash, which was just fine. This I'm really particular about. This is the Tree Hut Shea Sugar Body Scrub in Coconut Lime. I've tried other scents of this and I really like it. You can just get it at Ulta and I think they might even have these at Target if I'm not mistaken. But anyway, really liked this. Also another body scrub was this Coconut Body Scrub from The Body Shop. It was a little small one. I didn't have the big one for some reason, but I had a little tiny one that I finished up. And here is a Microdermabrasion Face Exfoliator from number seven. I absolutely love this. This I'm obsessed with. Go out and get you some. I finished up three cleansers, Clean and Clear and Neutrogena. Liked them just fine. Okay, so speaking of cleansers, I have a legit obsession with makeup wipes. I only like one makeup wipe and it is the Target Up and Up makeup wipes in the blue packaging. This is the old packaging that it came in and this is the new packaging that it comes in. I'm obsessed, they get the job done, they take off mascara and eyeliner and brow gel and all of that without a problem and they're very inexpensive compared to some of the other things that are out there, guys. So definitely look this up for you. What? No. Look this up for you. What am I talking about? Anyway. So definitely go grab some. Oh. I finished up three bottles of the Tea Tree Toner. I've talked about this many times. I absolutely love this. The skincare stuff and the makeup, I'm really specific about. Um, so I absolutely love this. I found out what works for me in my skin and I haven't gone back since and this stuff is amazing. I finished up one of the Tea Tree Skin Clearing Lotion also from the Body Shop. Pretty much this whole range I use. Um, and then I also finished up two of the Night Blemish Lotion. Yeah, is that what it's called? Yeah, the Night Blemish Lotion. And then I finished up one of the Tea Tree Oil in the same range. I get mine at Ulta, but you can get them online at thebodyshop.com or I think you can just go into a body shop and get all of this stuff too. It's really great. And at night I use this. It's the L'Oreal Paris Age Perfect Night Cream. It smells so good. Like, it just smells fresh and kind of like reminds me of my grandma a little bit. I don't know, it just smells fresh and clean. It smells really good, but it's not like perfumey, like grandma perfume, it's just like clean grandma. I don't know how to say it. I should like not put that in there. Maybe I should edit that out. Maybe I won't, I don't know. But this stuff is great. You can find it at the drugstore. I really, really love this. All right, and I've only got a couple of makeup items. The first one is the Origins Vita Zing SPF 15. This isn't really 
makeup, but it's not really skincare. It's kind of both. So just kind of put it in with the makeup for you guys. I really like it and I've used many, many tubes of that. This next thing is the number seven beautifully matte. Uh, it's a makeup base, so it helps like mattify the skin. I use this every day without fail, and this is definitely a game changer and a lifesaver for sure for me with like crazy oily skin. So I love this stuff. This CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous, I was in the number 110. I actually have another one of these in my vanity right now, which is right here. Um, I absolutely love this stuff. It's really great for a drugstore foundation and I will keep using it. The next item was the Rimmel Stay Matte. This is their just powder. I am in color 011 Creamy Natural. You can't see the color because I used it all. But this is great to just set all my makeup at the end of my routine. And the last makeup item that I have, for the face at least, is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume in the waterproof version. The color I have here is very black. I tend not to like brown mascaras for whatever reason. I don't know. I tend to like the black one. Um, but that is in the little orange tube and I absolutely love it. The waterproof version really helps with like less fallout underneath my eyes throughout the day. So love this stuff. I'm pretty sure I have another tube in my vanity. And the last two items are nail care. I have this, it's the out the door, it's like a top coat, it's great. However, I've had this one for a while and it got kind of goopy towards the end. So this is definitely gonna go a bye bye um, So highly recommend it, I really, really like it. The last thing I have here is from Julep and this is the Mighty Nail and Cuticle Serum. And what this is, it has like a little brush on it and you could like twist it up and then like put you know your cuticle oil on which was kind of nice but I ran out of that a while ago okay so that is it for my empties video I hope you all enjoyed it was not as long as I thought it was because I have so many duplicate items because I tend to buy the same things over and over and over unless I'm introduced by a friend to like some holy grail thing that they absolutely love then I'll try it out for myself. So if you guys have any holy grail like skincare or body care, hair, makeup, anything, leave me a comment below and let me know. I'd love to test out new stuff and maybe it'll show up in an empties or even a favorites video. So if you guys have any questions for me, feel free to post them below and I will get back to you. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Make sure to subscribe for more fun videos from me and I will talk to you all very soon.